All right, uh, so this lesson is very important. We will see how we can make and design curtains inside Blender using only the tools that I uh, use uh, have been existed natively inside Blender. I am now in this collection, no matter uh, the name of this collection. And firstly, we will make an plane. Make sure that you are in the front view uh, to make an plane which is rotated in the x-axis. And let's see that this curtain around 4 meters. So I will scale in x. So we have this to be 4 meters. Because we will shrink to be 3 meters. So I, I have make it to be 4 meters. And uh, to in the z axis we will scale 1.6. Alright. And uh, in the x axis I will make a lot of loops. And in the Z axis, I will make around 50 also. And after that, I will select the top edge and make a vertex group assign. After that, let's make and shape K basis and this one, which is the deformed. And after that, let's scale in X axis such as this value. We should have the timeline to be here, 100 and 200. In frame 1, we will make value to be 0. In around 60 frame, we will make value of 1. And let's insert an keyframe. So this is our animation. After that, we should go straight forward to the close simulation. And uh, quality steps may be 9. I will make it 10 you can choose any preset but let's go straight to the bin group in the shape I'll select the group and after that in the collision you should select equality I will make it maybe 5 self collision and distance 0 0.001 which is 1 millimeter after that we are now done and I will click on the cache after that, let's save. Saved. I will put the link for this uh, file in the description. End to be 200 only. And let's pick all dynamics and wait. It will take around two or five, uh, up to five minutes. So let's pause the video until it's finished. Uh, so let's see what we have got now. This is. Uh, final result uh, you should pick the frame that you find which is best suitable for you so i find this from here to here is rest and there is no value so we will select from 120 120 this is maybe fine and i find this is maybe fine and after that we will select the close and apply as shape K don't be afraid from that we will go straight to the shape keys and delete this basis and delete the deform well now uh, ready to apply some subjoint surface and firstly it's smooth shading and apply subjoint surface if you have the time this is with subdivision surface and this is without so if you have the time you can use the sculpt mode and uh, some details and don't forget uh, to uh, add uv and rub and a texture but uh, this is just uh, was uh, be homework for you and that's it uh, if you want to extend you can duplicate in the x or add an array let's make something different i will add a curve circle make the origin to be here and let's make the origin to 3d cursor and selection cursor selected selection to cursor that's fine we will add curve modifier 
and add an array modifier we want that array to be above and uh, if you want to make it collapsed or be have distance and that's fine this is the best amazing curtains that you can see you can select all and move in the axis i will leave the model for this curtain in the comments and finally don't forget to parent your curtain to the curve you can move the curve here and as you can see if you want to see the statistics uh, for this file we have around faces 80,000 it's fine and that's it so uh, that's concluded for this video I hope you enjoyed this tutorial see you in the next lesson